Dominic, with the, being here, I was here for two weeks, and then so what progression have you seen from my first couple of days here to now, especially with my neck opening up and just my ligaments and overall pos like posture? From a practitioner's perspective, muscle tension is way down. When Chunky came in here, he was tight as a snare drum, especially <laughs> yeah. on, on, the, on the right side of his body, so there was a lot of pulling and twisting. So that's dropped down probably 90 or more percent. Yeah. The tension in his mid to lower neck was so high that it was locked, like it, it was just yeah, one it's solid always, always piece. Yeah, like hard and just like it's a, all, all one piece. Yeah, it's one, one piece. Now it's all like smooth. It's like almost like kind of jelly almost. It's great. You're welcome. I never knew my neck. Yeah, thank you. I never knew my <laughs> neck was supposed to be soft like that. I always thought the normal thing was for it to be really tense and not move. That was just the normal I always lived my life by. So it's cool really for me to wake up and say, wow, my, my whole body can feel so much better. Yes. Yes. And that's what it's supposed to be like. Yeah. Um, so can I share with the audience what patterns yeah. I worked with? Exactly. So Chunky had uh, a lot of tension at the very uh, top of his neck or, or just under the base of his skull. That area is associated with fear. So he had a lot of tension, which caused his head to protrude forward and, uh, and carry his head yeah. forward, which is fear physiology. So, which means he's yeah. more stressed, he's more reactive, his tension's higher. Kind of like this. This is a good example. I throw my head, especially if I'm eating or doing working on the computer, I'll just kind of naturally start doing this. But after doing the two weeks, I'm just cognizant and aware now. So, like, say if I'm sitting and driving and stuff, I'm my, putting my chest out more and putting my neck back and then just kind of working on my body to stay like that. Because it's not like a quick instant, you just do this one thing, you're fixed for the thing. It's kind of sticking with it, which is huge. You gotta be conscious of it. Yeah, it's, it's like there's a progression. Every time I work with someone, we get tension to drop more, their range and their posture changes yeah. a little bit, and we keep chipping away and their posture changes more and more. So it's kind of like a, um, um, a removing the tension and creating the space for your body to do something with nice bite-sized pieces. Yeah. And over a half a dozen, a dozen sessions, it's amazing to see people's bodies transform. And, and not that you, you're, um, what is it, uh, uh, 65 to 80% of our communication is nonverbal. Yeah. So if someone's going through life in this fear physiology, that's not, that's not gonna work out. That, that leads to a lot of issues. Not only your emotions that go with fear physiology, but also how you connect with other people. Yeah, the people around you, how they're affected, your family, your friends, they'll, they'll kind of replicate you a little bit and go into their own fear physiology. But if you're all in the positive, all in that good stuff, they'll start kind of doing that. The good well. stuff, I like that. <laughs> you wanna be in the good stuff. Thanks for making it simple, Chunky. Yeah, uh, um, so it's nice to, as a practitioner, to be able to work with people and create more peace in their body so they have more of the good stuff yeah. <laughs> inside and then life is always a mirror so you get more good stuff from other people and yeah it kind of and it just keeps bouncing up building more and more stuff it, the more you do it the more it kind of snowballs effects really well because once you start to paying attention to your body it's easier to do so i love it i highly recommend it yeah right on thank you All chunky right. <laughs> and, and there's a lot of truth to that so when chunky says it kind of snowballs the, the reality is, is the tighter someone is, the smaller changes they make initially, but the more and more open we get the person, the more peaceful we get their body, the bigger and bigger jumps yeah, the they changes, tend to, yeah. the bigger the changes. Whole range of motion too, like I can bend down and touch my uh, toes, no problem. Like my, just exercising too at the gym, it's a lot easier, I'm a lot more fluid, I'm a lot more in, in the moment and present with it before I, I use a lot of, the, especially the breathing exercises and techniques, I started applying that to working out and it made it so much easier. It's like, wow, why was I not working out like this before? 